Hey, what's up, y'all? Um, I don't know who really need to hear this, but I'm going to be honest with you. If you really, ladies, if you really trying to be successful in your business or you got a new endeavor that you're trying to pursue, the best thing you can do is stay single. I promise you, as a living witness, 100% of the women that I know personally. Now, if I don't know you, if I don't have your number in my phone, I can't pull up on you. We don't talk. I'm not talking to you. But 100% of the married women that I know are miserable. Okay? For whatever reason they choose to stay or whatever, I know for a fact the women that I know, miserable. I just had somebody, a married woman in my car, and all they doing is she arguing with her husband. Get off the phone with him. She complaining about him. Statistics. Because it's always a man that get on here, that's why you single. When a man tell you that's why you single, take it as a compliment. Okay? Straight up. Because statistics. I don't really like to quote statistics because all of that stuff is, don't matter to me. I know my reality. But statistics show that the happiest people are married men and single women. The majority of the burden of your marriage is going to fall on the wife. I don't want to hear shit. None of that about you men. First of all, if you got a good woman, a lot of y'all do not appreciate her. You know, but I'm telling you from what I've seen and from my own experience as just taking the time out to be single after my relationship, I would not have been as successful as I am in my business, my new business ventures that I have if I was in a relationship. Men are too fucking needy, then they competitive, and then they jealous. It's always, oh, well, oh, you don't ever make time for me. You don't this, you don't that. It's always complaining about what you don't do. I ain't got to listen to none of that. I could walk around the comforts of my own home, butt-ass naked, and eat a bowl of cereal if that's what I want to do. I ain't got to worry about somebody coming in asking me, man, what you, what you cook? You cook some, you know, man, you know, slapping me on my ass or whatever. You know, just what, whatever it is that women go through, what I've gone through being in my relationships. Listen, being married is something that I don't look forward to. It's not a desire of mine. It's not a need for me. But for those of you that want to do it, make sure you marry the right person. Because marrying the wrong man will set you back mentally, financially, and spiritually. And then for the, you know, the men in the back that's going to get on here and talk about, well, that's why you lonely, you this. Nothing that you can say to me on this here internet is going to hurt my feelings. Because nine times out of ten, it's coming from a bum, broke ass man. man. A bunch of bombs. Because the only men that reply and make comments under women posts are men who ain't got shit to do. The men who actually making money, who happy in their marriage and they keep their woman satisfied, they ain't on this app responding and replying and making comments. It's only the bum ass men that ain't got shit else to do. You you clocking out because you done done you done with work. You don't even want to pick up no extra hours because you want to do the bare minimum. It's only y'all that's on here on these apps under women, you know, videos and, and making comments. One thing I don't do, I don't comment on other people's stuff. Because, you know, we all got opinion and we all live a certain type of reality of life. It's just that from in my reality and what I've seen, there are more miserably married women than there are happy. Now, like I said, if you are a happily married woman, congratulations to you. But the majority of the women that I know personally that are married are unhappy. They miserable for whatever reason. You know, a lot of them are dealing with very narcissistic men, men who will rather compete with their woman than collaborate. They all, all they do is complain. Y'all the new women. I promise you all that nagging and complaining and that needy shit. A lot of y'all don't even know. A lot of y'all wouldn't even function in life properly if you didn't have your woman to help you. That's why, and, and case in point, two married couples, been married for years, right? Say the wife dies. So, no, just say the husband dies and she becomes a widow. Nine times out of ten, that woman is going to remain, she's not going to remarry. Because she don't, she, listen, she, she said her husband gone. But she also relieved. And she ain't trying to do it again. 
majority of the men who lose their wife majority of the men who become widowers when their wife die honey uh, check and trust and believe that rebound relationship that rebound woman gonna be at the repast fixing her plate of fried chicken and potato salad because men can't stand to be alone y'all don't get it y'all need women more than women need y'all that's just what it is majority of the men that i know they can't stay single they got to always have somebody because they don't know how to function without a woman women we be doing we just fine